Welcome back to my channel. How's it going, bros? My name is PewDiePie. <laughs> Anyways, I'm Asuma, and today we're going to be taking a look at Barugil, or Bounty Hunter, depending on which figure you have. But, uh, um, shit, what was it? <laughs> I have Bounty Hunter, which is, uh, Interesting. Anyways, this is a different video from what I normally do. So, anyways, let's just move on. <laughs> Fuck it. Yeah, look at this. I, I painted him. Well, we'll get to that later. Um, this guy has nice wheels. Some nice. Uh, um, some nice. Some nice wind, wind shields. No. What the fuck am I saying? Uh, mirrors, side view mirrors. You can roll pretty well, you can do all that kind of stuff. Um, yeah, this is his Lamborghini mode, which is pretty much just a basic Lamborghini without a logo. And as you can see here, there's kind of a bit of, um, defect, I guess. Because the sticker that they put on this kind of stuck to it and it fucked it all up. Yeah, it's just terrible. Horrible, horrible service. Terrible service. Zero, zero out of ten. Anyway. <laughs> Anyways, um, let's get to the transformation. Let's, let's, let's turn this car into a robot. Which is what it's meant to be. So first you want to just untab these. And uh, I guess you can turn them around if you want. Doesn't really matter. Uh, pull this off, pull this off, um, yeah, just do that, straighten that out, tab those up, and just untab this, let's see, Un untab this, uh, stretch out the legs, I guess, um, oh, I forgot this, you wanna just, um, kinda just fold that, that there put that there and just lock that and then the leg just um oh shit oh yeah it goes this way okay so that's one leg done and another leg is to be done let's do that let's do this twist that around plug that in fold that up oh yeah and fold these parts up too As you can see, I actually painted him gunmetal gray, but uh, we'll get into that later. So now you want to untab this, fold that down, all the way down, fold this up. Oh my god, I gotta like, I gotta raise the camera. Okay, now um, what I usually do is just fold this down. Pull these out, plug that in. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> uh, plug this in, and then plug these bits in. Plug that in, and then what I do is I just do that. So it's flat. Uh, you want to untap this, of course. Um, you want to like bend this back and uh, plug this in the tab there. Uh, separate this piece. Put it over the head and don't forget to move these things out. They're like this. You got to push them up. Push this down. Oh my god, it's it's falling apart. Uh, da, 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 da. Those down. Tab everything into place. Just uh, yeah, get get it all up in there. Push this down. Put that down. Unfold this. Tab this into there. Twist the hand around. Twist the thumb around. Uh. 
flip that out, put that in there, put that there, flip that around, twist this around. Do flip the thumb around. Ow, my hands hurt. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Gotta tab this in. That around. That out. And here we have Peru Kill. Now, one of the things, well, actually, it's Bounty Hunter, but whatever the fuck. Um, take this, tab this in there. This is what I usually prefer to do. Tab this in there. Oh, it's parts forming. Fuck off. Um, and yeah, that's, 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 that's Peru Kill. Look at him. He's, he's awesome. So I actually did paint this figure a, um, gunmetal silver gunmetal because he just looked kind of bland and boring. So yeah, you I mean the figure was all right. It was just, just a flat black. It was just all black. Like, it was boring. You can't even see, like, the details and shit. I painted his hands silver, as you can see. And let's get into his accessories. Oh, God. Okay. Oh, so... What he comes with is this knife hook thing, which he used to attack Optimus in the film. He also comes with two doggos, except one of them I gave away to my sister. This one's holding the seed. The seed. He's holding the seed. Anyways, the articulation on the dog is pretty cool. He's got a mouth that he can open and close, move his face all around. His arm can do that, do that, do that, rotate, you know, just, just do whatever. Move out that far, move in that far, you know, just, and then the legs could just go that far and go forward that far. The knees can go back that far and they can go forward really far, like about there. It kind of looks gimped. Again, a ball joint, so it's a full 360. Up, down, yada, yada, yada. And yeah, I actually painted the dog too, if you haven't noticed. Painted it silver. And this part, I actually painted gunmetal. Um, one one problem I have with the dog is this, this arm is too flimsy. It's just, it's just not, it's, it's not good. Terrible service, horrible service, disgusting. Get out of my face. <laughs> Anyways, so how you apply this hook is you um, take his hand, pull it around, do that, push that there, and then you just shove it into the hole. And there you have the hook. He has the hook hand. He's going to murder you with a hook. Yes, the hook hand. Yeah, that's that's that. And he also comes with this big fucking face gun, which has some nice um bullets, I guess, right there. Pretend that's shooting. Anyways, um, has like so this um since this isn't like the official Peru kill. One of the biggest problems that I have had with this figure is that it doesn't come with any die-cast metal parts, which sucks. It really does. <laughs> I was really excited to get this figure because of the die-cast parts. But, um, shut up, cat. Anyways, <laughs> so to um, apply this, you just want to fold that back. I'm gonna take this piece, pull it back, do whatever with this, and just take his face and just, you know, 
just um just really get that in there I never really I can never really do it properly just squish squish anyways and then just tab this into there for balance or whatever and then here he has the uh I'm gonna shoot you face or the gun face I mean, it's cool. It's cool. It's all right it's for what it is. It's cool. Yeah. Anyways, let's uh. So to attach this to his arm, you just wanna take it off his face. Oh, another accessory he comes with uh, is an alternate face, but I lost that. I don't know where it went. It's gone. It was just his mask where he um, you know, came out of the water and he turned his gun into a face. I mean, there's, he turned his face into a gun. <laughs> so, shut up! My god. Cat! Shut up! Oh my gosh, so annoying. <laughs> so you just want to pull that out, pull this up, and take his hand and just pull that in there, put that there, and just tab this into the hole. That sounds wrong. <laughs> tab that into the hole, and there you have it. He has a gun. Tab that back in. He has a gun. Just tab that back in. Yeah, it's so annoying because it keeps like untabbing and it just it won't stay tabbed in. Fuck. Come on, just uh, you can shoot you now and hook your face off. Now is uh, it's not very stable. So I've had this figure for about a month, over a month, and honestly, it's pretty cool. This is honestly I've wanted this figure for so long. But it's so disappointing how he doesn't have any die-cast metal. So, as you can see, I, um, yeah, the paint. Take a closer look at the paint. His face. That face is really awesome. I also painted the hook. It was just a black plastic. Kind of boring, kind of bland. I just painted it gun metal. And to be honest, I think he was kind of like shiny in the movie. Like he was a lot shinier than he is right now. Oh, so um, for articulation, kind of disappointing. <laughs> Because I thought all of his fingers were individually articulated, but I guess I was wrong. So it's just it's a hinge right there, it's a hinge right there, it's a hinge right there, and then this thumb is just on a ball joint. You can move whatever it wants. He's got a double bend at the elbow, double joint, I guess. He's got it in and out. You can move up. You can't move out that much. It's kind of disappointing. You, you can only move out like that. And like, you can't really... Like, just, it's really limiting. It's just... You can't put it at an angle. You can only put it like that. You just... If you wanted to point out like this, you kind of just have to do that. Uh, same for the other side. I guess this is kind of... Counts as articulation. It's really limited. It's just wish it could move out more. Anyways, the head is really well articulated. Look side to side, down. You can look at his own chest. <laughs> you look up. You look at an angle over there, down there, down there. And that's as far as it goes. I mean, you could kind of do that if you want. I don't know. He's got 
waist swivel. He's got uh, about. <laughs> He's got that that far up, about that far, and that with the butt flap out of the way, that far back. Move down, kick out that much. Good um, double bend at the knee, the knee. Oh my god, this is really annoying. He's got a ankle pivot, kind of up and down, except this kind of gets in the way when you want to move it up, I guess. So, there's that. And yeah, that's pretty much all his articulation. I mean, he's got a few, like, springy parts, but we don't talk about that. They're supposed to be metal. Where's my metal? Oh, shit. Oh, you son of a bitch. Um, anyways. So this is a lot different than my normal gaming videos, but I wanted to do something like this for a while. Anyways. So final thoughts, uh, I would give it a 8 out of 10, because I've wanted this figure for a long time, but the articulation is just kind of limiting, and the fact that there's no die cast metal is just disappointing. And honestly, this isn't Peru kill, this is Bounty Hunter. Bounty Hunter. I got him off eBay. So, there's that. And for size compare, ow, fuck my finger. Uh, I have, here is Optimus the Prunes, which I might review in the future. So here he is next to a Voyager class, I guess. I can't remember if this is a Voyager class or I can't fucking remember. <laughs> there he is next to Optimus the Prunes. I call him that because he's like a million years old. He's like the world's oldest man. Um Yeah. Uh one second. Here he is next to the Studio Series Lockdown, which I lost the arm because the arm broke. Piece of shit, worthless, I hate it, get it out of here. Uh, this is so much better. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Now to transform him back into the vehicle, let's... So let's just uh, let's take this off real quick. Oh, and one more thing about um, his gun. There are tabs on his back that this could tab into. Yay! Anyways, so you want to untab this. Hinge it back. This is already untabbed. Tab in his, uh, untab this. Fold his head down. You wanna, like, push this all the way there. And just unplug these. Well, actually, I should put this back up. Do his hands first. Do to do. Just do to do. Ah, 
got to take this out of the fucking thing. It's so annoying. Ah! You son of a bitch. Anyway, let's just put that there. It's just, it's just terrible part. Anyways. So just pull that out. Now you want to, like, take his chest. Untab this. Fold that down. My good boy. My child. Scooch these down. Oh, fold these up. Scooch those down. And just, oh my god, just, just tab that in. The, one problem I have is that this doesn't like to tab in all that well. So you just, oh well. So now you just want to take his hands, hold them together, fold this up, and tab that in. Then you want to... Forget what is it? This way. Yes, yeah, this way. So you want to fold these up this way. I hope this makes sense. Fold this up. Fold this up. Do, do, do. So it looks something like this. Then you want to first of all fold these out. Fold these out. And what I like to do is just untab all of this. And ow, my arm fucking hurts. Tab this out. Do, 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 do. Fold this up and tab that in. Just make sure it clips in there. Tab this. Just tab that in, squish everything together, and that should be it. And there we have Peru Kill. Or Bounty Hunter, depending on which version you got. And I like to call him Bounty Hunter, uh, Peru Kill, but he's actually called Bounty Hunter. But whatever. Same figure. Final thoughts. Good, good figure. Good, very good, very nice. Anyways, I'm going to end the video now. See you guys later. I'll try to upload some gaming stuff and some some high energy bullshit. And some uh animations. But uh yeah, see you guys later.